My name is Stephen Hawkins. Three and a half years ago, I was homeless, self-harming, taking tablets to try and commit suicide. I heard about, obviously, the trials for the Homeless World Cup. So, at that stage, I wasn't really interested in football. I was just <sighs> trying to, obviously, just trying to commit suicide. I didn't want to be here, and I put my head down, and I kept going, and I kept going, and. I got picked, became 12th in the world. One of the best experiences of my life. Other than my child being born, nothing will top that, you know. At that, I met a girl. She was the coach for the girls' team. As you do, you just texting each other and stuff like that. And then um, ended up getting together and stuff and have a beautiful child. We live together now, we have our own house and stuff like that. I wanted to get a job, I wanted to support my family. And that's what I'm doing now at the moment. I'm a chef in a restaurant in, in the city centre called Top Blade. This coming Sunday, I get the chance to cook for the Northern Ireland senior squad. I'm going to bring my jersey down and I'm going to get a sign and I'm going to put it into a frame with a cap and a medal and then it's just going to be something for the child to look up to when, when she's grown up. To represent Northern Ireland um, was a big thing for me because I always wanted to be I wanted to be a professional footballer, you know. You don't you don't have to be great at football, you know, it's 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 just all about taking part and people that are in a similar situation to me. I was three years, three and a half years ago. If you look on Facebook, just follow the Street Soccer NY page and all the poems are there and give them a call. I'm on Facebook myself. If you need to chat, just give me a shout and I'll be happy to pick up the phone and give you a call. I think without Street Soccer, I probably, I wouldn't be here today, you know. Thinking back on it now, you know, it's, it's very foolish of what I was doing, but there's help out there, you know, there really is, like, and hopefully my story is an inspiration to other people to go and get the help that they deserve and that they need, um, because obviously you're not alone in the world, you know, it's, there's plenty of people out there that can talk, and if I can do it, anybody can do it, you know, that's, that's, that's really it.